of the operations you may frequently need to do with OCalc is to take the results of a large number of analyses and export them in a fashion that can be easily imported into some other target system within your organization. Um, one of the tools that's built in to help you do that is the export tool, which allows you to, similar to the way a batch reporting tool works, select a whole bunch of polls, perform an analysis on each one, and then take selected attributes, package them into a CSV file, and um, create that so that you can import it into another system. So let's take a look at how that works. If I go to my export batch poll info, I get a tool that you'll recognize if you are familiar with the batch poll report tool. So let's say I want to add, I'm just going to add a couple of polls real quick, real, real quick, um, like so. And now what I want to do is decide what I'm going to export. Now I can either have named sets that I've previously made that show all the things I'm going to export for that tool, or I can make, make my own. So um, let's say... I'm going to export um, uh, on the poll's actual length and something I've stored in Ox Data One, and um, we'll go into the summary block, and we're going to say I'm going to export the MCU value and the height of MCU and the wind angle and the last thing I'm going to do is I'm going to export the polls ID because that makes sense. All right, so there's my poll EFGHI ID. Okay, now I can reorder these things. I can drag them up and down. Um, but, you know, if I have to put something all the way at the top, so I want the poll ID to be first, I can sh simply select it and then right click on it and say move it to the top. And now if I go to the top, poll ID is going to be first. Uh, um, and let's say whatever the heck I've got here is going to be second and now I'm go, go ahead and ready to do my export I say export my info it says where do you want to put the CSV file um, I'm going to say I want to put the CSV file on my temp folder and call it export and I click save and off it goes and it goes ahead and starts processing the polls it loads each up one up individually and it exports exports the data that I asked for so you can see how this would be very useful if you needed to get data out of OCalc Pro, especially sort of selected results data, or even selected um, data that was simply attribution, and get that into some other system.